up guys? I'm here uh, cooking a mahi-mahi recipe for you. It's gonna be a pan-seared recipe. Um, the ingredients, I'm kind of winging it, but I'll show you everything I'm making. And I'm gonna make a little topping on top of the mahi after I'm finished. So I have some cucumber I'm gonna chop up, some tomato, some onion, and a little bit of red pepper. And cilantro. Oh, wow, I had a brain freeze there, sorry. <laughs> um, here's my fillets that I'll season up. Here's the seasonings I have. I have black pepper. I have a little bit of salt, sea salt. I might try this Boston Bay seasoning. I might not. It's kind of uh, old and clumped up. I have this salt, pepper, and garlic blend. I'm definitely gonna put that on there. And then I have this mango magic. So that's all the ingredients. And then I'll be cooking it in extra virgin olive oil along with butter uh, for my pan. So all right guys, I saved you the time on chopping up all the the toppings here. I'm just gonna add a little bit of lime. Set that aside. Guys, I forgot to pat down my fillets to dry them down. Pat them down with a paper towel before you season them up. First, I'm gonna add this blend. It's salt, pepper, and garlic. Flip it over, do the same thing on the other side. I'm gonna add a little bit of this mango magic. Just to give it a little mango flavoring. And then I'm not gonna add this. So. A little bit of salt and pepper to the mixture. That's it. So that's all I'm gonna do for now. I've already added about two tablespoons of olive oil. The other fillet. I'm gonna let them sit on about three to four minutes, depending on how fast they cook. I have some yellow rice cooking over here. We're gonna put the, the fish on yellow rice. There's a white line on the mahi that will start moving up. So when it gets about halfway, that's when we want to flip it. Mm -hmm. Alright, they're about done on one side, so I'm going to go ahead and flip them to the other side. Let them 
pretty good. So we'll let that sit for about three minutes. See what we got. All right, guys. So looks like our rice is done. With this, the fish is done as well. Go ahead and take the fish up and put it on a plate. Set that aside. And then we'll put rice and our toppings on. All right, guys. We have the rice and fish ready. Add a little bit of lemon on the fish. Add our salsa. Stop. That's it. We have pan seared mahi mahi or yellow rice. With the background. Enjoy the recipe. If you liked it, please subscribe to my, my channel. Hit the like, hit the bell notification as well. Peace, see you next time. Ooh.